Hello guys and welcome to The Fat Show. My name is Steven. Hi, my name is Barbara. Barbara is a very special friend of mine for all the right reasons. I was going to say on some of the wrong ones, but okay. Uh, really? <laughs> well, Barbara is a very special friend of mine primarily because um, I have seen her really put in that work, you know, that takes you from the point where you're like, oh, I don't like this, I don't like that, to that point where you know that stuff is actually happening to you. I mean, doesn't she look gorgeous, by the way? She actually looks gorgeous. gorgeous. You do. Okay. You do, girl. You do. So, today on The Fat Show, Barbara is going to be joining us to show you some of those things that you need to do to get your body from point A to point B. And then, point, what is this point? B, C, B is good. What Please edit out the D part. <laughs> I'd say for a guy it's the P. That's the perfect shape. Yeah, because you know, I, I just assume that that's the chest up there and then that's the rest of you down there. Okay, so for ladies, what do you for ladies, uh, wow, that's, that's, that's a tough one. X. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's like, you know, wide shoulders, tiny waist and then well, X. Yeah, X could work. Yeah. It could work. It could yes, work. Yes, yeah. I got it. Yeah, so like, X, X shape. You know, the point where they join together is very tiny, so and then, at least has to be very tiny, then it's very tiny. You know, the fun part about bodies is the fact that um, the society changes from one year to the next. There was a time when, you know, you had to, if you were fashionable, you had to be extremely skinny. Yeah. And these days, we're going for fuller figures. So, mm -hmm. it's not Full a big deal. That kind of thing. Anyway, whatever your shape is, whatever goal you're trying to achieve, right here on the Fat Show, we're going to lead you from where you are to your promised land. We're here for you. Today on the show, as always, we're going to give you some isolation exercises, stuff that will work really good for your body. But I want to give you a tip first. Now, here's a trick. Even for someone who likes to work out as much as I do, there are some mornings when you wake up and you don't want to do it. Yes. You don't want to go anywhere. You don't want to work out, you just want to stay in your bed. The trick to getting out of bed is one, I always put my alarm far away from me. I don't leave it by my head, by the bed. I put it in such a place that if I have to turn it off, I need to get out of bed and go to the alarm. Yeah. And quite frankly, my alarm ringtone is annoying. So there's, <laughs> there's no getting up, shutting it off and then coming back to bed or you know just ignoring it. The moment your feet hit the ground, you have to get exercise and then tip number two go to sleep in your comfortable workout clothes hmm. this for instance is very comfortable i could sleep in them sleeveless and shorts or a t-shirt and shorts so at the moment i roll out of bed in the morning i have like a warm-up routine roll out of bed hit a couple of push-ups my brain is awake okay. shut off the alarm clock and then you know okay. start out the day so that, that's that's my trick if your gym clothes are not comfortable enough for you to sleep in get the comfortable kind or sort it and you're for one night. <laughs> All right. Enough chit chat. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. So, um, yeah. As always, the first thing to do is to warm up. Do uh, you have any particular warm ups you like? Yeah. So, um, I think the best warm up to do is jumping jacks. Okay. Yes. Jumping jacks it is. Put your body in the mode. So, you need to and do it Okay. One, two, three, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Warm enough. Sleep is out of your mind. You're ready to hit that exercise. <laughs> You're still sleeping at this time, my friend. We need to pray for you. Okay, so from the warm-ups, the next thing that happens is the exercise. Now today I have three isolation exercises that eventually you can actually add a lot of stuff to and it will make your body actually pop. One is called burpees. Not very popular, annoying, but very effective. Very, very effective. Very, just a very annoying place, very effective. Burpees are kind of annoying, primarily because you have to go all the way from up here, you know, to all the way from up there to, to, to the ground itself. Okay, so we're going to demonstrate the burpees and then as soon as you have it, you move on to the next exercise. 
your burpees are pretty simple. If you want to, you could go from a standing start to the ground, okay? So instead of jumping up, like a lot of people do, and that's, that's still very okay. If you jump up to start your burpees, it's good. But if you want to stand and then drop to the ground for your burpees, it still works as well. So I'll go real slow from a standing start and then to the ground. So this is your position. And then you go down, palms first, hips drop low, and back to the stand, okay? So let's go through that step by step. First step, you're standing up, palms to the ground, kick your legs out, you can drop your hips if you want. Burpees, pretty simple. Now if I was gonna do that a lot faster, it would look something like this. Okay, so it's very simple, you can do it, just get your form right, and then you can kick up the pace as much as you want. From burpees, the next thing we'll go to, another exercise that actually gets your entire body moving. Very simple stuff, you can actually do it as a warm up. High knees, what do I mean by that? You simply kick your knees up above your waist, okay? Alternate knees, left knee goes to right arm. Have fun with it, that's the entire purpose. Have fun with your exercise routine. So you could do this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Easy, right? So you don't have an excuse, okay? So you've got burpees, high knees, and then your mountain climbers. But before we go into your mountain climbers, Barbara and I are going to run through burpees and then high knees and then we'll take the mountain climbers. Are you ready? What are you going to do? How many sets are we going to do? Let me take it easy on you. <laughs> easy on me or easy on people watching each of them? Easy on you. Okay. Easy on you. Because Barbara is a beast. She... See? Okay. See? That's not true. I was trying to be modest. <laughs> okay. So we're going to do five burpees and then five high knees. Okay? You follow along with us as easily and as freely as you can. As always, I like to emphasize on taking your time to get into an exercise so that you can get your form right. There's nothing as terrible as bad form when it comes to exercising. If you don't do it right, you will hurt yourself. And if you don't do it right and you don't hurt yourself, you might develop the wrong muscle. <laughs> Let me look at your eyes. Well, you've got a few there. See, a few biceps on your left. On your left <laughs> yeah, right. All right, so burpees on three. One, two, three, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. You ready? She wants to go more. <laughs> she I can only do a hundred. <laughs> oh All right, so the next thing we're doing is high knees. Remember, you simply alternate one knee to the opposing hand. So it's left knee to right elbow right knee to left elbow pretty simple exercise and what that does for you is it works your entire body now your thighs of course your legs are involved because you're stepping up so you're working your calves your thighs and all of your lower body it also works for your abs especially the lower abs it helps you actually give them that kick oh wow i love those burpees oh, yeah lower part oh yes that's the worst part <laughs> it's very easy to move here down, but it's very difficult. To that move. blob of fat, fat like yes. there. Okay, so. I think that's where the baby lies. I wouldn't know. Maybe, maybe I haven't like carried the baby before. Position in the form of, you know. Carrying. Yeah, right. <laughs> so I've got, I've got some education today. The baby is down there. Yes. All right, so um, very simple. All you have to do is alternate left to right, okay? So real slow so that you can get it. Barbara will demonstrate. Your right knee is coming up to connect with your left elbow. Now, as much as possible, don't do this. All right, don't, don't, don't drop your upper body into it. Don't curve your back. 
keep your body, your upper body straight. It's just your legs that are moving here. Okay? One, two, three. Right knee to left elbow. Boom. And back. Okay? All right, so on three. One, two, three, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Easy stuff, easy stuff, but it works a great deal because your abs are getting that workout. Your obliques, that's the muscles. There's a, there's, a, there's, a, there's a whole bunch of muscles all over your body. You've got these ones right here that need that workout as well. So, Barbara, very good. You twist as well. So, we're going to take the high step as a beg your pardon. We're going to take the high knees again and make sure that we give that good twist so that our knees can connect with our elbows. All right, on three. Woohoo! Yeah, I'm feeling it. One, two, three, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, remember, lift those knees up, twist your body. It may not be easy, but hey, you'll get there eventually. Stay straight. Oh, yes, be sure to stay straight. Now, Final exercise before we let you go for today is mountain climbers. These ones are real bad boys because as always, they work out your entire body but in a different position, okay? So mountain climbers, you assume the position on the ground. I hope you're ready because we are raring to go, burning up, breaking the sweat, which is what you should be doing by now. All right, mountain climbers on three. One, two, three, and we're down here. Okay, so you always kick off on your left leg. Now one way to ensure that you're actually putting pressure on your abs is to keep your head up. You could do this, but when you do this, there's an extra pull on your ab muscles, okay? All right, so on three. One, two, three, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. All right, guys, there you have it. Our three exercises for the day. So easy. Oh, yeah, and so much fun. Yeah. This will help you break out that sweat. I don't believe you're, not, I don't believe you're working out if you don't break a sweat. I mean, what's the essence, okay? You need to burn up all those things you don't, you don't want to have in your body and then some of the things that you want to have as well. Please edit that part. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we are sweating off. Round it up. All right, guys, so that's all we have, we have for you today on the fashion. Big, you round up. Okay, guys, so that's all we have for you for today on the fashion. That's all we have for you on the fashion today. Join us right here on Nima Box. Nima Box Live, right? Okay. Join us right here okay, on Nima guys, Box Live. That's all we have for you on the fashion today. Make sure you join us next time on the Nima Box Live. TV. On Nima Box Live TV. What else? Big shout out to you, Marie. Thank you very much for Daddy, letting us. Daddy, let me finish up. Sorry. <laughs> we have you to finished give Marie, up yesterday, that's We have to give Marie a shout out. Really? Because she keeps giving us her studio. Okay. So She's an awesome dance teacher, by okay, the way. Okay, you give her the shout out. Let me finish. Please. Sorry. Okay, that's what we have for you all. That's what we have for you on the fast show today. My name is Barbara. Show. This is Steven. Okay. And this is, you say your name, Marie? Yeah. Okay, guys. So that's what we have for you for Messi. That's what we have for you on today's edition. Okay, of that's fashion. what we have for you on today's edition. Hello, please continue. I'm ready. Okay, guys, that's what we have for you today on the, the fast show. show. So make sure you tune in next time on the Lima Box TV. Okay. To watch what you need to do for your body to be very hot and sexy, not like mine. Okay, I'm not okay. Hey, but I like you. <laughs> okay, I'm Barbara and um, I'm Stephen. Big shout outs to Marie. Thank you very much for loaning us your studio. We love you. We love you. We love you. We'll see you next week. We do love you. I love you. <laughs>